this is furniture with a difference. Printed using a special technique. Jacqueline Brock Obermann specializes in making distinctive products. The Berlin-based cabinet maker is one of the first in Germany to offer a range of this kind. Customers can choose from some 500 different patterns, from chintzy prints to Art Nouveau or retro style, or have something custom made. If someone wants furniture to match their nice carpet or wallpaper, then they can take a photo of it and send it to me as a digital file. I can then create a design from it and print the furniture with the pattern. Jan Stenz is a regular customer. He's already had a room divider printed here. Now he wants a coffee table and discusses the specifications with the furniture maker. You can buy everything from desks to hall tables at Muster Mubel. The 11 basic designs can also be altered to fit your particular wishes. The wood has to be specially treated to absorb the paint. The boards the furniture is constructed from can't be more than four centimeters thick. First, they have to be sanded down. I prefer using block board, or maritime pine, or multiplex. Wood laminates or composites are well suited to be printed because they lie nicely in the machine. They're flat rather than warped. And they're not as expensive as solid wood. Jacqueline Brock Obermann discusses details with graphic designer Jan Kusner. The pattern on this table is meant to go over the edges. It's precision work. The machinery fires the paint at the wood like a giant inkjet printer. The digital printing process took months to perfect. In the early stages, we used the silkscreen printing method. In contrast to digital printing, you can even apply gold. But it's very time-consuming, both from a practical and aesthetic point of view. Silkscreen printing is a lot more expensive. And with digital printing, the wood absorbs the paint in just 15 minutes. And you can still see the grain of the wood. The surface came out good. From start to finish, each piece of furniture takes around four to six weeks to create. The coffee table will cost around 600 euros. Now it just has to be glued together, varnished, and assembled. This is the best moment. You make the design and then start to construct the piece. Then you take it to be printed. And then afterwards, when it's completed, that's a really nice feeling. For the customer too, of course, especially if he or she has had a hand in its design. We changed the colors a bit and then gave her the pattern back and she had it printed. So we had the feeling that we contributed. A one-off design from a creative workshop.